Hello, everyone, it is a great honor for me to share our recent work published in iMeta, Shiny Circos, V2.0, leveraging the creation of Circos plot with enhanced usability and advanced features. Circos is a visualization tool developed by Krzywinski et al. in 2009 for comparative genomic studies to display the similarity or difference of genomic features. It can display genomic data in a circular format and can easily display SNP sites, Indel sites, gene distribution, and DNA methylation, etc. Up to now, the original Circos has been cited by 8633 times. A typical Circos plot consists of multiple concentric tracks, each representing a different aspect of genomic data. Each track is divided into multiple sectors, which are organized in a circular manner, representing different genomic regions. Within each sector, genomic data can be represented as cells, which are rectangles representing a single region. Circos was originally created as a command line tool using the Perl programming language. Circos diagrams have won widespread acceptance for the visualization of genomic data. This has led to the development of other tools such as BioCircos.js, Circulator, Circlize, etc. Shiny Circos V1, developed in 2017, is a web application for creating Circos diagrams online, which has been widely recognized for its graphical interface and ease of use. Since its release, Shiny Circos V1 has received a lot of user feedback including bug reports and new feature requests. This, we developed Shiny Circos V2.0. Shiny Circos V2.0 has a total of eight pages, as was shown in this slide. The first step to make a Circos plot using Shiny Circos V2.0. Decide whether to use a predefined reference genome. Upload the input dataset in one go or in batches on the data upload page. Distribute the input data correctly and click the button to save the data. Click the submit button to submit the data to the The second step to make the Circos graph using Shiny Circos V2.0. Set the parameters of each input data, such as the data type of chromosome data, the drawing type of track data, the drawing index of label data, etc. Click the button to make the Circos plot using the current data set and draw. The third step to make a Circos graph using Shiny Circos V2.0. On the Circos plot page, you can see the Circos plot created using the current data set and plotting parameters. Users can download high quality PDF and SVG files of the created Circos plot. Users can adjust the advanced parameters of the Circos in legends, adding track indexes, highlighting genomic regions, etc. Users can also download the R code used to make the current Circos diagram to further enhance the Circos. In Shiny Circos V2.0, Users can now add text labels to indicate the index of all tracks. Specific genomic regions can be highlighted. Added y-axis for supported tracks to indicate max and min values of the input data. Add a color legend. Use the midpoint of the link to draw links, etc. The detailed help manual in Chinese and English on the help page of Shiny Circos V2.0 explains in detail the input data format and drawing parameters of different drawing types in Shiny Circos V2.0. On the data upload page of Shiny Circos V2.0, users can choose to use the example data set to create a Circos graph. On the gallery page, we provide 30 Circos diagrams created using Shiny Circos V2.0 and their input datasets. The source code of Shiny Circos V2.0 is freely available in GitHub. Users can use Shiny Circos V2.0 online through either of the two URLs. You are welcome to contact us through using email and provide your valuable suggestions. If you used Shiny Circos V2.0 in your study, please cite our paper published in iMeta, a journal to change the world.